Hey there. On this episode, we may witness me getting attacked by a monkey. That'd be sweet. Not. So there's one somewhere in the trees, just up the hill from here, somewhere up there. Uh, usually they run away from me. I've switched directions and it's paralleling where I'm going, so I haven't quite had that happen before, so let's hope this doesn't get awkward. I do not hear Mr. Monkey. So far every time I've stopped and seen him, that's where he takes off, so maybe if he thinks I don't know where he is, he'll stop moving, but uh, yeah, I'm not going to find out. He's pretty big. Uh, I only know that because he was way up in the tree and still looked big, so I freaking got ants all over me. Here's a good example of, you, you can see my line choice here. So I tie the knot on the trail side of the tree. So I'm actually to the left of these two and then I'm to the right of this big tree there. So the trail goes down, down, up and over. And we're coming from this spot where this thing will be out of the way, but you can see my line right here. So at that point there, I'm at 15% down. And I, then from here is my low spot. And then from up there, I'm up to, that's 10%. So I'm going with, I'm coming down a steeper part and coming up a less steeper side that we should be able to get pretty far up that without really having to do much pedaling if we dig this out right. If we leave it pretty rough, it'll be a little bit harder, but that's my reasoning behind that. I also, in segments, where you have a bigger tree like this one, uh, I could easily have kept it to the left, but when the slope is kind of at this angle, I want to stay on the high side of that tree because the roots are going to get exposed down here as we ride over it and the roots are kind of mirror the hillside and like I said in the first video the roots don't go down they stay across the top so they are going to pop up and when they do you'll ride over this and it'll you'll slide across the roots off the hill so I put it on the top side it does two things one the roots will expose but they'll be more with the tread um, and then two, it, it just helps hold the trail in place. It won't wash away and hopefully yeah, the, it'll just be easier to ride. Yeah, so this trail is going to do a little bit of up and down and all, all the all the directions in, in one. Um, I didn't want to make it Descending only. I want to have a little bit of both in it, so it's yeah, it's a little more interesting than a continuous down. People need to get used to pedaling and stuff. That's what bikes are for. So this trail does a little bit of everything. This is where we're headed. Up that way. Kind of wander back down the hill after we do this little climb, but this dirt is amazing. It's the perfect kind of stuff to dig in. Um, yeah, it feels good, looks good, digs good too, so I'm happy with that. I would 
stay out here a little bit longer, but I really don't want to make this monkey any angrier than he already is. 